Hey everyone, I'm doing this video for Mr. Checkpoint. I've seen this on Instagram, so I figured I'd screen record it and show you guys. Also, want you guys to know that he has a YouTube channel, but he's not always posting on there. I think he spends most of his time on Instagram and Facebook, maybe. So if you guys get a chance, go check him out on Instagram as well. But I'll definitely put the link for his YouTube so you guys can go check him out on YouTube. If you don't know, Mr. Checkpoint is badass. He's been out there recording police for a long time, and he's out there actually. He actually helps the homeless out too, which I truly appreciate as well. And uh, one of the things that I really want to highlight is Mr. Checkpoint started an app and uh, this Checkpoint app where basically you guys can go to the app and sign up and let people know on the app where police are, traffic stops and checkpoints or whatnot. So this is a good thing, guys. Watch this video. Like I said, go say what's up to Mr. Checkpoint. Thank you, guys. Uh, what are, what's that, Officer Reed? Wow. You know who I am? You're Beverly Hills Video on YouTube. Just you, huh? Hey, Mr. Checkpoint? Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We can't pound it. Oh, shit. Wow. Yeah, stay safe, man. It gets crazy sometimes. I say it gets crazy sometimes. Can I tell you, though? I'm going to be, I've been, I was out, I was on Melrose uh, at midnight last night on, you know? Yeah, it got wrecked but, but let me tell you this. Uh, not, I was more afraid at all times by the police. Oh, yeah? At all times. At all times. They were incredibly aggressive and it was scary as fuck. I had zero fear of even people looting. And, you know, it was not... Some people, they put cars on fire. Yeah, you know, they're angry. This is emotion. This is it. I know, but still, I mean, not, they, they it's not violence. It's uh, businesses, you know? It's not cool, but... Oh, what a minority business. But you know Own what? Businesses, but you know what? Yeah. All that stuff's replaceable. Most of... And this isn't an excuse. This is just a reality. All of it's replaceable. All of that shit was closed oh, anyway. Hold on, hold on. All of that's, all of that's, all of that's closed. A lot of it's been closed anyway for coronavirus. All of them have insurance money, first of all. Most of them will be able to get that's that. That's an assumption on your part. Hold on, let me just say the last thing. The reason it's all happening and we're here is because lives are lost every day by people who wear your uniform. And that is never coming back. And that pain and trauma lasts for decades or centuries. Would you agree with that? necessarily. I think that's incredibly insensitive, but okay. I mean, you asked for my opinion. Yeah, yeah, no, and I just said I think it was so, I mean, do, do I believe there's a deep rooted issue, you know, that, that goes way back? Yeah, I mean, there, there definitely is. It's, it's a societal issue, you know, as a whole. That we all have to and come together and work, work towards making better, you know. It's supposed but, to be. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, it's a double whammy for people. Hey, is your, is, your, is your camera on? What's that? Is your camera on? No, it's on. You put it on? Or why wouldn't it be on? I like them all on, you know? Hey, you want me to hurt you? Always. Always film the police. You're a public sir. Before you guys get on with your wonderful selves, I want to read this quick review from a true revolutionary. I haven't used this app yet, but I don't need to. The fact that this app exists in the first place is a milestone for technology and its ability to improve people's lives when used appropriately. This may seem hyperbolic, but Mr. Checkpoint needs to be considered for the Nobel Peace Prize. Police violence runs rampant. Police are there to protect and serve their communities. They are employees of taxpayers and they should treat their job as such. They should get paid really well and have a fantastic retirement program, but only under the condition they put the common citizen's life before their own. It's a hard and dangerous job, but if your instinct is to shoot first and ask questions later, then you're in the wrong profession. Film the police. Hold them accountable. Use this app. I don't know if they should get paid handsomely yet until we get rid of what, folks? Let's all say it together. Let's get rid of one, qualified immunity. Let's get rid of number two, internal investigations. Let's get rid of number three, police unions. And number four, let's make police hold their own insurance so that when they make mistakes, it comes out of their pockets not the taxpayers. With that, everyone, thank you so much. Give yourself a big old giant hug for me, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace.